Well, thank you very much for your invitation. My name is Laurent Arnaud. I'm a professor of rheumatology in Strasbourg, in the northeast of France. And you kindly asked me to talk about uh, smoking and SLE. So, of course, I'm convinced that you are already convinced nobody should be smoking, obviously. Uh, but I think there are some specific reasons why people with SLE should not smoke. Uh, as a patient, you are probably very concerned about your health. And I will show you that there is a very strong impact on smoking uh, on the disease. Uh, the first thing is that smoking actually increases the probability to have SLE by 1.5. If you compare the patients that are smokers versus non-smokers, the likelihood to have SLE is increased in smoking. The second thing is disease activity and disease damage. Those two are more frequent in smokers compared to non-smokers if you are an SLE patient. Then there's something which I think is really important, is the response to treatment. Uh, I can take a, a treatment which is very commonly prescribed in uh, lupus patients, hydroxychloroquine. Well, we know that in smokers, the likelihood to be cured from the skin lesion with hydroxychloroquine, if you are a smoker, is divided by two compared to the patients who are not smokers. So I see many reasons why people should not smoke when they have lupus. Of course, there's the general risk of smoking, lung cancer, thrombosis, but also the disease is more frequent, it's more active, it leads to more damage, and the treatments are not working so well if you are smoking. Thank you very much.